Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the video, and today we're taking a quick look at what I deem to be the top weapons in the Assault class in mid-2017 before we hit the In the Name of the Tsar DLC. This isn't a full review, I go into much more detail in my individual weapon analysis videos with figures and statistics etc. This time I'm just going to give you some quick pointers as to the current meta weapons based on their popularity according to BattlefieldTracker.com and my personal observations. You are allowed to disagree with me. So let's get right into it with the most obvious pick, the Hell Regal 1915 Factory. When I covered it recently, the vast majority of people felt that this weapon was a cut above the other SMG options, and more than 50% of SMG kills currently come via the Hell Regal Factory. This is primarily down to ease of use. Its recoil is low, its range is strong, its magazine size is large, it's just a great all round weapon, and most of you probably know this by now. So let's move on to pick number 2. The Automatico Storm. This is the second most popular SMG choice currently, and it's not hard to see why. It's very simple. Its raw killing power at close range can be scary in the extreme. You could go for the trench variant, but honestly the Storm doesn't feel like its hit fire misses too much at the super close ranges you should be using it at, and it comes with the advantage of better control and accuracy when you do happen to need to aim down sight. Really it just keeps things very simple for you. You can rush hard and spray people down, often very quickly and without much precision needed. Our third and final pick for today is the Model 10A Hunter, and this shouldn't surprise anybody. With over 70% of shotgun kills currently coming from this weapon, it's got extremely high damage, extremely long range, and absolutely ridiculous hipfire. On console it also has the added benefit of aim assist pulling you to the target. The only downside is a slow rate of fire, but you can so often either kill the enemy or leave them extremely weak with one shot that it just doesn't matter. It's the god of shotguns on this game. So those are the most dominant weapons in the Assault class in mid-2017, according to me. Let me know what you think in the comments section below. If you enjoyed the video, then feel free to like, favourite and subscribe. I'm GitGoodGuy and I'll see you next time. Laters.